Astaxanthin protects retinal cells against oxidative stress and puts up a wall of defense that stops the growth of new blood vessels on retinas, which is a precursor of macular degeneration. Astaxanthin also restores retinal boundaries to normal in the eyes of glaucoma sufferers, which stops the cell death associated with this terrible affliction. Protect your liver. Here again, astaxanthin's ability to prevent oxidative stress helps this all-important and all-too-neglected organ to do its job of detoxification far more efficiently. Bacteria, dead red blood cells, viruses, and toxins are quickly removed, giving this overworked organ the break it deserves. Keep your arteries clean as a whistle, and keep your cholesterol levels healthy. As a result of astaxanthin's ability to reduce inflammation, the production of specific enzymes that destabilize plaque is reduced which in turn lowers the chance that this plaque will rupture and block blood flow. Therefore, your risk of heart attack and stroke is dramatically reduced. Also, a 2010 JK University study concluded that astaxanthin raised good HDL cholesterol and reduced triglycerides. Most scientists believe that the ratio of good HDL cholesterol to bad LDL cholesterol is more significant than any other cholesterol number. Astaxanthin puts this ratio on your side. Fight inflammation. Aging is a disease, and inflammation is at the core of it. Inflammation is considered to be a leading cause of serious illnesses such as cancer, heart attack, and diabetes. Astaxanthin is a potent anti-inflammatory substance that can attack these problems at their roots. The recommended daily dosage of astaxanthin is 4 milligrams. This amount is sufficient to obtain astaxanthin's benefits. However, remember that anything less will probably not be nearly as effective. Good food sources for astaxanthin are wild salmon, crab, shrimp, crawfish, lobster, red trout, carrots, red peppers, and other red pigmented vegetables and fruits. Astaxanthin is considered a GRAS, generally recognized as safe substance by the Food and Drug Administration, FDA. This means that a chemical or substance added to food is considered safe by experts. However, some people should proceed cautiously with astaxanthin supplementation. If you are taking medication for hypertension, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, thyroid problems, asthma, osteoporosis, or for that matter, just about any other prescription drug, you must get the okay from your physician or healthcare provider. This will make you aware of any possible interactions between your medicine and astaxanthin. Also, women who are pregnant or breastfeeding should avoid supplementation with astaxanthin. There is no reported danger, but staying away from anything that could be passed to the baby or the fetus is highly recommended. But for most people, astaxanthin is safe. Astaxanthin is made in two forms, natural and synthetic. When you take the natural form, you are getting the cleanest way. Some additives in the synthetic form are processed in a laboratory. Some of the ingredients in the artificial structure may be used only as preservatives or to deepen the color. These are not added to enhance the product's health benefits. So how do you know if the form of astaxanthin is natural or not? Read the label. If you have trouble pronouncing most of the ingredients and if you need a degree in chemistry to understand them, check for another brand. An excellent way to ensure your astaxanthin is natural is to look for the words natural astaxanthin on the bottle. Also, make sure it is derived from the marine algae species H. pluvialis. Synthetic versions of astaxanthin may have less than half the potency of the real deal. You know how destructive and debilitating aging can be. Painful, stiff joints, mental fog, and confusion. Formerly active people reduced to chronic fatigue and needing canes to shuffle around, muscle loss and weakness, lack of appetite, trouble getting and staying asleep, and the loss of independence and dignity. It's ugly. It's revolting. It's tragic. And perhaps the saddest part of all, it does not have to be that way. Knowledge and action are the keys to preventing aging from stealing the quality of your life. Understanding of what to do and what not to do to stay healthy and taking action to do what's needed to fight the disease of aging. For sure, there are no certainties and no silver bullets or guarantees that you won't suffer from these problems. But there are steps you can take to give yourself every chance in the battle against father time. Supplementing with astaxanthin is one of these actions that have been proven effective 
in this life and death struggle. Remember, many antioxidants cannot penetrate the blood-brain barrier and therefore are unable to provide comprehensive protection for all of your body's cells. What this means is this. Astaxanthin can gobble up free radicals in your eyes, brain, joints, bones, muscles, organs, throughout your entire body in a manner that other antioxidants can't. Astaxanthin is the gift that just keeps on giving. This is why ATX is referred to by many as the holy grail of antioxidants. Mother Nature has provided our bodies with the ability to weaken free radicals. But Mother Nature never envisioned a planet so full of toxins and pollutants like the one we are forced to live in today. Faced with that grim reality, the free radical army can keep making breakthroughs at the expense of our continued good health. Free radicals do damage in many ways. They destroy our cell's integrity and make us look much older than we are. Many antioxidants can help turn the tide, but astaxanthin is unique due to its unique ability to reach all parts of these damaged cells. As I mentioned earlier, due to astaxanthin's ability to cross the blood-brain barrier, it can penetrate cells thoroughly and heal and strengthen the cells far more efficiently than most antioxidants. You would be well served to consider adding astaxanthin to your life extension health promoting program.